Welcome to the nightmare. Trevor, hey, let's take a peek in the backpack. Yeah, probable cause. Yeah, your reputation. Well, let's see the backpack. <laughs> The mad farmer. You have opening schools lately? <laughs> you have to go through an x-ray every morning. How are you, trash can? I want to be caught in the men's room. <laughs> oh, excuse me. <laughs> Later, dark. Congratulations to the first casualty of zero tolerance. Okay, everyone, listen up. I said listen up. Any suspicion of violence, physical or verbal, will result in immediate suspension or expulsion. That is zero tolerance. All right, come on, move on through. Mr. Adams, let's talk in my office before homeroom. Trevor, how was your summer? Oh, just wonderful. Trevor, put the camera away, please. Uh, what made it wonderful? Well, between counseling and having to repeat my courses in summer school, it's a toss-up. You know, Trevor, a lot of parents call for your expulsion. But Mr. Olson and others supported your reinstatement. If you would be so kind as to provide me with a list of their names, I, I'd like to send thank you cards. Why are you here, Trevor? Well, my parents pay taxes, which entitles them to one free public education. I'd like to continue anger management with you. But it's your call. You know, maybe I can help you through the tough spots. Say hey to him. Hell no, man. He might blow me up. He's one of us, man. He's too cool. <laughs> We are going to start with a broad survey of American literature. Hawthorne, Poe, Twain, and James. Pass these back. Mr. Adams. Poe, Twain, James, Mr. Adams. I doubt what you're listening to is going to help you on the SATs, Mr. Adams. Final pyramid, Mr. D? Ah, almost. Well, my calf muscle halfway out, man. What should we go for, Mr. D? Is it just a staircase? Yeah, I hate stairs. Six feet high. Oh, that's what I said. Oh. Hey, Trevor. Wait up. Hey, good to see you again. How's it going? Summer school, bummer school. Hey, listen, they screw up your schedule. I got you in my video class, but not in drama. Yeah, I'm done with theater. Well, when you change your mind, there's always a drama club, right? Oh! <laughs> How's the mad bomber? Come on, you know better. It was just a fix. Oh, yeah, I remember when I went through that, the teenage terrorist phase. Downloading a terrorist cookbook, making bombs, trying to blow up my school. There was no real bomb. Yeah, the only thing it didn't have was an explosive. Well, you made a mistake, you need a second chance. Look in that kid's eyes, I swear I can hear him tick. Where's your ring? The engagement's off. Oh! Oh! It's off. Ah. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Don't drown in your crocodile tears. <laughs> Oh, 
can't just sit where you want. Why not? Who are you with? With? You have to be a varsity or a cheerleader to sit at this table. Or know everybody. That table's for the druggies, stoners, deadheads, burnouts, and the hippies. That one, preppies. Then you have the skateboarders and skateboard chicks, the nerds and techies, up against the wall, the wiggers, hip hoppers, rednecks, goths, and all manner of freaks, troublemakers, losers, sluts, gays, floaters, and the trogs. Trogs? Troglodytes. Freakiest of the freaks. Well, where do you sit if you just want to have lunch? Hey, I'm Brad. Do you want to sit with me? No, thanks. <laughs> Hey, good going last year. What? We're standing up and down. You want to sit with us? No, thanks. That's cool, man. I got this play off the internet. I really like this play. I really want to do this play. I want you to play the main character. You're joking. I'm not joking. I'm not getting up in front of these people. Why not? Give them another reason to trash me. I don't think so. Will you at least read the book? That's the point. Hey, uh, what did you want to see me for? Hi, Jenny. Um, Jenny, Trevor, Trevor, Jenny. Hi. Jenny just moved here from California. Saw her some regionals last year. Awesome, awesome Juliet. To be reading Katie, the female lead. Well, maybe it wouldn't hurt to read it. Yeah. I'm on lunch duty. Let me know what you think. Do you mind if I sit here? Lots of room. So I was just given an education on the pecking order here. So what's your classification in the hierarchy? Pariah. So how'd you get to be a pariah? Well, you gotta make up your mind and persevere. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Well, you get the whole table to yourself. Pariahs have good perks. So you want to read the play together after school? Yeah. Your video must be no longer than 10 minutes. It must have a beginning, a middle, and an end, and it is due in three weeks. Uh, if you start now, you'll have plenty of time. Remember, I want you to give free reign to your imagination. Explore a fantasy, whatever that means to you. Go outside the box. Let the video camera become an extension of your mind. Boys, be nice to the girls and vice versa. See you later. Be good. No. Okay. Why not? This year's gonna be hard enough. Okay. But, um, Trevor, why don't you decide who you are before someone else does? You should be more careful about the company you keep. Pardon me? That guy you ate lunch with? Nobody goes near him. Break it off if you know what's good for if you. If you want any friends in this school. What that guy knows can kill you. I don't get Josh at all. What, do you mean like killing kids? No, I get that part. I just don't know how you can kill the girl that you love. Well, but didn't he feel betrayed by her? Yeah, sure. Well, have you ever felt like that? 